Hello, welcome to the Wild Gut Project. My name is Carrie. This is all about being vegan and low FODMAP for irritable bowel syndrome. And today I've got a super quick but delicious recipe for you. So this is a pasta dish I've been making a lot recently and to be honest, it tastes so good because of the smoked tofu by tofu. It's so good. Normally the flavorful marinated tofu you get in the shop is just teeming with FODMAPs. It's got garlic and onion in there, sometimes like molasses, and it's not a, not a good one on the low FODMAP diet, or if you're sensitive to those FODMAPs. Um, so this one is literally just tofu, which you can have like 160 grams of to be a low FODMAP portion, which is loads. And just it's just been smoked, so there's nothing else in there, which is fantastic. And this dish in particular, I think it's just, I love it. Let's just go on with the recipe. For the ingredients, you're going to need about one tablespoon of nutritional yeast, some courgette. This is about 70 grams of gluten-free pasta, just check it's low FODMAP, not just gluten-free. And some garlic infused olive oil, about a tablespoon of pine nuts untoasted and some salad to go on the side. Now this is a low FODMAP portion of courgette, 65 grams and not even half as much as I used to eat in one serving, but we're working with it. And then this is the smoked tofu I love. And as you can see in the ingredients, if it's not too bright, it's just tofu. So we're going to really finely chop up the courgette just to make it go further, chopping it into matchsticks. And then we're going to do the same with the tofu. I think this kind of mimics smoked lardons, but obviously no animals were harmed and it's much better for your health and the environment. And for the pasta, we're using, this one's actually from Lidl and their gluten free range is really good. So comment down below if you have also noticed their great range. I'm adding some salt and some boiled water, obviously, and then a dash of olive oil, which really helps it not clump together. So I'm just stirring it around, making sure that all those sticks of spaghetti get coated. And then in a frying pan, I'm adding a little bit of olive oil, those matchsticks or courgette, along with the tofu at the same time. And I'm also going to add the pine nuts, which are going to toast along with them. So you want to just cook it down basically for the time it takes to cook the pasta. It should start to go a bit golden. The courgette should go soft. And if you like, you can add a little bit of dairy-free margarine. It just adds a silky, creamy gloss to it. But just, I think it just makes it a bit more pleasant. And once it's all golden in places, the pine nuts are toasted, it's ready. That simple. So I'm adding the pasta straight into the tofu courgette. Um, this is because in one second I'm going to pour some of the water from the pasta in as well. Again, this kind of adds to the glossy, creamy coating, otherwise it can be a bit dry. And I'm just going to mix those together so it's evenly combined as much as possible. And it's also a good time to season, so salt and pepper to your taste. I'm serving this with the side salad because that courgette portion to me is not a good serving of a vegetable. And then I'm going to drizzle on that garlic infused olive oil now, it's off the heat. And also that nutritional yeast, kind of like a parmesan substitute. If you're so inclined and it doesn't irritate your tummy, you can have some chili flakes here as well and they're really delicious and go very well with this. And there you are. Quick, wholesome, delicious, tasty, savoury, smoky pasta with courgette and tofu. So I hope this has inspired you a bit. If you give it a go, please, please, please tag me on Instagram. It's just at the Wild Gut Project. Um, so I just love seeing that. And are you equally obsessed with the smoked tofu? It's just, yeah, so good. I make a video on this general topic with kind of recipes and resources and tips and things every Sunday evening, so subscribe if you want some more of that. I promise I don't always just rave about smoked tofu. Um, and if you're already subscribed, thank you so much for your support and I'll, I'll see you next Sunday. Bye! <laughs>